Hey everyone, it's Alan from Rhapsody Music Lessons, and we've got on page eight, The Archer. And I've been going through this book, which is the super easy songbook, Taylor Swift. And this is for my students who are more on the beginner level, but they really want to learn some Taylor Swift music. So what this book does, and this goes for adults too, it's for anybody. This book has chords at the top of every page showing you where to put your fingers and I'll go over that. So there are four chords per song. You don't have to turn any pages. Once you've opened your book, it's a two page abbreviated version of the song and every note is labeled. Okay, so if you're struggling or just learning to read your treble clef, this is going to help you out a lot too because the notes are labeled and you can kind of commit that to memory. The more you play, the more you'll remember. So in the Archer, we've got four chords. The first one is a C. Now here's middle C. You're going to take your left hand. That's what's going to play all of your chords and you're not mid on middle C, you're on the C below it, and you're going to play from bottom to top, C, E, and G. Then you just move each finger up one white key, and you're on your D minor chord. Keeping your pinky on D and your middle finger or finger three on F, slide your thumb up to the B flat. That's the black key here. That's your B flat chord. And to get to your F chord, it's real easy. You're going to move your thumb down to A and your pinky down to C, leaving your middle finger on F. And it's a good idea to practice going over these chords until you feel comfortable with them. Just take your time. this way shorter and longer keys your black keys are a lot shorter than your white keys because you can slide into them your right hand is going to play everything you see that's written here these are your notes these are your melody okay now above the melody you've got these little letters which are chord symbols and each one of these matches what you see up here so i like to call these a finger map Okay, these are finger maps telling you exactly where to put your fingers. Now I'm going to go over the melody with just my right hand and then I will put both hands together. Okay, so that's your right hand. Now we're going to put your left hand with it with that C chord that's written up here and just follow the chords and the melody, put them together. Hold your left hand down.
Okay, that's the Archer. I hope this helps. And I'm going to go through every song in this book. We've got quite a few left. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.